What's up guys, it's Paralyzer here, and in case you've been living under a rock somehow, Grounded 1.4 just got announced. So today, we're going to cover everything that has been confirmed, we're going to go through the trailers that have been released, and we'll be taking a look at everything at Grounded 1.4. Now, as you can see here, we're on the blog post on the official Grounded website, and it says Grounded celebrates 20 million players, congratulations, and gets ready to welcome more on other platforms. We have this little image here. This is the first image we get. As you can see here, there's a little little teaser here. Hoops is holding the dagger a bit differently. This is the widow dagger, of course, and she's holding it upside down for some very strange reason. Um, maybe they're changing the dagger animations. I'm not too sure. We will see. Uh, Grounded will be digitally released on April 16th for PlayStation 4, 5, and the Nintendo Switch, which is cool. It's now going to be on every console. It's on PC, Xbox, both PlayStations, and the Switch. You'll love to see it. It means everyone gets to enjoy Grounded. Grounded will also release its 1.4 updates simultaneously as the new platforms are released, so everyone can play the content together. This is insane. We knew nothing about 1.4, and all of a sudden, it's now in two months' time. Um, I wasn't expecting it for three to four months, so to know that it's in two months is very cool, especially because that's April 16th is when the update will release for everyone. Maybe on Xbox and PC we'll get the playtest, because obviously they need us to fix the bugs for them before they release the update. So there's a good chance if you're on Xbox or PC, we'll get to play the update a couple of weeks early using the playtest, which will be very, very cool. So we're looking at the start of April, which is just over a month away. Stay tuned for pre-orders of digital copies for PlayStation 4 and 5, and the Switch, which will open soon. Very cool, yeah, I'm... Probably not going to buy it on either of those consoles, I have no reason to. Maybe I'll play it on the Switch just for the scuffed graphics, because it'll be funny for a video. Then we have a video here, we'll take a look at the videos in a minute. Um, they're just blah blah blah, and then they give us this big poster here. Now, if you've not seen the movie, this is in the theme of The Goonies, which is an amazing movie. I don't think they're doing a Goonies collab, I think they've just gone for a similar sort of theme since the movie was released in a similar sort of era to when this game is set. And uh, this is the full-scale poster. I have to admit, this looks sick. This is an epic thing, and um, I think it's a teaser to 1.4. I think uh, One-Eyed Willy may be making an appearance by the looks of it. We also have some gold coins in the image as well. Like we mentioned, the Widow Dagger is the wrong way up. Moldock Castle, maybe something to do with Schmachter in the update. And the Fire Ants, which we'll get on to very soon. They're in the poster for a reason. And then he just goes on to talk more about the update and Playgrounds mode being in the game, which everyone already knows. They just really, really want people to play it. Um, okay, so if we go over to the Grounded Twitter, we will also find the uh, exact same poster over here. And um, they're just talking about the update. They posted the trailer over here, but we're going to watch the trailers on YouTube. So this is the first trailer posted by Obsidian, um, which is Grounded for All, coming to Nintendo and PlayStation. Let's go ahead and give this a play. The biggest backyard adventure has some even bigger news. Grounded is coming to the other consoles. Finally. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Very cool. It's just showing off all the different areas of the yard. Now, most of you will have seen this trailer, and a lot of you, you'll have seen it. You're thinking, Paralyzer, why are you showing us this? This is just a grounded trailer. There's nothing in here. Is just telling us that the game's coming to other consoles. Well, you'd be wrong. If we go through the trailer um, in very, very slow speeds, we're actually going to see some things that you uh, didn't even notice first time around. So the first thing we're going to notice here is this sword right here. You can see my mouse cursor. This sword right here that Willow is holding. Um, I just somehow managed to mess that up. There we go. So let's go frame by frame. No, let's go frame by frame here. You can see she's holding a brand new sword. Um, you can't really see it too well here, but it is a two-handed minty sword. Uh, none of the other characters have anything new in their hands right here. Um, and then it keeps going with the trailer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grounded's coming to these consoles. Uh-huh. And then right here we have uh, just the two characters walking in. Nothing too crazy here. It does look like a different weapon in Willow's hand. It's actually just the Black Ant Sword uh, that she's holding there, along with a torch and the Mother Demon armor. Max just has Assassin armor on. Nothing too crazy. Yeah, it's just a Black Ant Sword right there. It's a weird little scene here. Um, Hoops is holding a hammer, and it's like using the hammer to build the walls, which just isn't how Grounded works. I don't think this will be a change made. I think they're just 
they've just done that for the aesthetic, probably. Um, again, nothing new in this scene here, as far as I could tell. Don't think there's anything here. Uh, we have the teens swimming away. We've got just, you know, regular underwater gear that you'd expect right there. Nothing too crazy. Salt Morning Star there, little spear there as well. Nothing new here. Um, right here, you're going to see something new, though. If you look right here at Willow's hand, you're going to see an item. And most of you don't know what this item is. Most of you just think it's some sort of staff. You're right. But it's actually the Fire Ant Queen staff, or the Ant Queen staff, I guess. We don't necessarily know it's a Fire Ant Queen. Um, but that does confirm that the Ant Queen will be coming to the game. I guess it is red, so it's made out of Fire Ant parts. Uh, yeah, there's a Fire Ant Queen getting added in 1.4, as you can see by the staff. That pretty much confirms it. Uh, this will very likely be in the Fire Ant Nest. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to fight the Fire Ant Queen. It's going to be a good time. I'm assuming this staff is going to summon ants, potentially. We will see when the update releases. And then right here, we get a really good shot of this sword. It is very clearly a mint sword, which is interesting because we already have the mint mace. So why do we need a two-handed mint sword as well? I guess we'll find out when we play the game. And then that's the end of this trailer. Nothing too crazy. Two new weapons were shown off in that trailer. And then there's a Switch version of the trailer as well. Now, this trailer is... Ready to embark completely garbage quality. I'm going to be honest. Um, I don't know if it's because it's on the Switch or if because it's just terrible, terrible quality. This is 1080p. It looks like 240. It's, it's bad. Um... I'm sure the game doesn't look this bad on Switch, but it's not ideal. Uh, they've got gas masks on here, nothing too crazy in terms of weaponry, I don't think. No, they've got a mint mace in this one. Yeah, I mean, let's be honest, the game on Switch is going to look like a potato, because every game on Switch looks like a potato. That's fine and understandable. Um, and I'm sure I will play it for a meme for a video just so I can laugh at how um, god-awful it looks because it's probably going to be pretty bad. That's what the Switch is. It's an outdated console. Um, yeah, not seeing anything too new in this video right here. It looks like everything I've seen in Grounded before, to be honest. I'm just going through it slowly to make sure I don't miss anything. Was that a toenail scimitar there? What was that? Yeah, just a Tornel Scimitar, nothing crazy. Yeah, again, looks looks pretty regular here, nothing too crazy. That's just a spicy staff. This guy's yappa yapping. Um, yeah, just some weed stems, a hot tub. I don't see any new armor in the trailer, which is interesting. I'm hoping there is going to be new armor, and they just haven't shown it off. Some poor, poor guys had to build this entire mansion on the Nintendo Switch. you got to feel sorry for them. Um, but it's just the same trophies as usual, nothing different that I can see. He's got an eye patch on, really, Max? That's a weird choice of gear. Fire Ant Soldiers. Yeah, just, just looks like the regular 1.3 stuff, nothing 1.4 related in that trailer. Um, so yeah, that's everything that seems to be uh, that's been teased in the 1.4 update so far. I'm most excited for any new story that they add, which will most likely be um, related to this uh, Goonies poster that has been uh, released. Uh, that's going to call it for today's video, though. I hope you've all enjoyed. If you have, don't forget to leave a like on it. And I am so excited for Grounded 1.4. I am going to go and make a predictions video. I had an entire predictions video ready to go yesterday. And then they managed to release a trailer for the update. So all my predictions have been screwed and I need to remake the entire video. But I will see you all in that video, which will be out at some point during the week. I will see you all later. I hope you all have a great rest of your day.